what is going down YouTube it's your one and only we got hard HD now I definitely know I've been gone for a long time but yeah this is college hoops 2k8 and I'm gonna do a legacy with a team now it's not Santa too good what you see in the background and I'll be doing 10 minutes and everything else is pretty much set the same nothing really different you know at first I couldn't really pick who I wanted I, you know I see me scroll through these teams right now and now you see Florida Gulf Coast up there once again now they were a 16 seed in the tournament this year, and they were pretty good. I was really surprised they almost beat the Gators, and I, that's my favorite team. You know, if I take Florida Gulf Coast, that'd be cheating. <laughs> so I couldn't do that, or any big team like that. So I just wanted to have a run with any type of team I could think of. I say maybe decent, 70 overall-ish, maybe something like that. 76 at the highest. Nothing 80 plus. Nothing like all the big schools. Just wanted to pick a, like a small school, you know. Try and go all the way. You see me looking at California Poly, Pacific, UC Davis, UC Irvine, which I did see some of them play their um, conference championship games. And they're not too bad of teams. Here I'm looking at Toulouse, Southern Miss, SMU, Rice. Kind of thought about them. I said, nah, I don't feel, really feel like picking that team. Also took a look at some of the independent teams, such as Longwood, CU, Bakersfield, Chicago State. Didn't really go towards the Ivy League. It was just not a thought. I think it was Loyola, Maryland, which is actually a local school to me. St. Peter's, I thought about them also because I used to play with them a long time ago. I looked at some of the teams also in the Mid-American Conference, like Buffalo, Kent State, Northern Illinois. And, the, and of course, I won the MEAC, looked at North Carolina a and and a couple other schools. I was looking at the Mizzou Valley Conference, looking at Northern Iowa, Southern Iowa. Wichita State, that also would be cheating there, number nine seed this season. That wouldn't even be fair. And if I pick Florida, yeah, you already know. And I kind of thought about Chattanooga. I've thought about it for a little bit. I actually know somebody's cousin who used to play for the team. I was like, maybe. And UNC Groomsburg, who has actually has one of the top 50 players in the country in scoring right now. I was thinking about it, and I also thought about Texas A&M U, uh, Texas A&M CC or whatever it is. And then, you know, I just said Sam Houston State. And I said, you know, I think I'll do something good with this team. They're in Texas. They don't have, like, the best schedule. Don't really know too much about the team. They're in the set. And the Southland Conference, which Northwestern State also won their conference championship, and they wanted to get into the tournament, which, of course, they lost in the first round to Florida, I believe, or whoever they played as the 14th seed. Now, here you go with the coach, Jason Jason Hodden, I believe is how you say his name. Of course, I didn't change any of that extra stuff because that would just be wrong and be cheating myself. And you see right here, I was thinking for a minute. So, you know, I want to have a good resume when I try and get to the college college championship, NCAA tournament championship, of course. And, you know, I said, I got to make sure I have a strong strong enough schedule. It'll challenge myself, and it'll, and it'll give you guys some good entertainment, of course. Now, I couldn't figure out who I really wanted because, you know, the games, you know, you can't necessarily get exactly the real-life schedule, which I was going to do. But because of the school's actual prestige in the game at the time of 2007, it wasn't high enough, I guess. But I don't think that actually matters that much in real life. It just matters who can actually make the game or who can't. So... I was just swapping through teams, and I said, you know, I think I got to pick some teams out of some tougher conferences like the ACC, Big Ten, you know, things like that. So I can have, like, a justified challenge. I just wanted, and I, and I decided to get, I only got one game from the actual schedule, and that's Arkansas, and that's the first game of their season in real life, which I believe they dropped that game. Yes, they did. They actually had a pretty close game, 73 to 68. Not a bad score at all. So not a bad, not a bad team. They can compete. So yeah, that that's pretty much what it's gonna be. And I believe that I'll be able to manage this team well enough. And yeah, I'm not gonna show all the scouting. I also did schedule Illinois as you, as you can see on the screen right there, which is a Big Ten team, since I couldn't get Indiana from their actual schedule either. Which makes a lot of sense. That's one of the best teams on land, even though they lost the other day. <laughs> but no disrespect to Indiana, it's a very well team. Surprised they actually lost so early. Well, not really early. I was surprised they actually lost because I had them going to the Final Four in my bracket. And also the, the shocker also in my mind was when Miami lost to Marquette. Which I didn't think Marquette was really dangerous as I remember Florida playing them early this season. They blew them out the gym. Crazy, right? And so here I'm still looking through a couple schedules. Still trying to make a few schedule changes. So I decided to go to the Mountain Mountain West or whatever what conference was it? Ah, the Big West Conference. There we go. And I decided to schedule one of the teams out of there, and I decided to pick. I decided to pick California Poly, which was one of the schools I also looked at to try and play, but of course I changed my mind. Now, 
I believe that you guys are going to have an excellent time watching this series, and I believe this series will be excellent. Also scheduled Texas A&M. I went to schedule Texas, could not schedule them either. Same reason. Prestige. That's my only problem. So, yeah, that's pretty much it for that. And then I'm just going to go ahead and send the recruiter for the first season, for the most part, just the ABL season, which is a very neat feature in this game. Feature I've, I've been playing ever since I got this game. I got this game back in 2010. I've had it for three years, and it's probably the best damn college basketball game I've ever played in my life. But yeah, as the simulation rolls on, this video comes to the close. Thanks for watching. Please comment, rate, and subscribe. This is We Got Hard HD, and I'm is out of here.